coming up to here is a school bus and it seems to be um, stuck on the crossing. So before we come make contact, preferably the crew comes to a stop here. It's just one of the emergency situations that future GO train operators could face in the Bombardier virtual reality rail simulator. There's a reason why this flagman is out there. In this case, this flagman gives the engineer instructions to stop the train. If you would have missed that flagman, then the crew would most certainly hit that uh, hit that bus. There there'd be no chance for this train to stop in time. 60 mile an hour speed, the, the train would not get stopped. They would collide with that bus. Great learning tool for the crews. Rather have them learn it in here than out there. And all potential GO train conductors must first start in this simulator. This is an, a, an actual engineer's um, workstation, really. There's brakes, there's what's called a reverser, this is a throttle, there's headlight switches, there's gauges for their air brakes, there's a speedometer, and there's also an amperage meter. And being able to have these screens set up like this, what, what does this allow for training? This allows. Uh, this is uh, exact layout of our track on the, on the GO uh, territory. So this allows us to, to run through different scenarios. There is so many rules to learn. It takes, it takes years. And the importance of knowing those rules is highlighted in this scenario. The, the rail traffic controller has mistakenly lined us up onto track one, onto track equipment and workers. So, so on we would. So, if oh, you kept going here, you, we're going to collide with that truck there. We would collide with that truck, and in workers, and possibly some fatalities would uh, would occur. Do you think that customers realize what goes into training to operate these trains? I, I think many customers would be very surprised. Um, even when you talk about the signals themselves, uh, it looks like a stoplight that you might come up to at an intersection if you were driving your car, but the combinations can mean more than 150 different things. If this was a yellow on top, it would tell me that there's probably a train two or three, four miles ahead of me. And they have hundreds of miles of tracks to learn. There's, there's stations to learn, there's signals to learn, pages and pages of rules on what to do in different situations. It's in depth. It's very in depth. You, we do not have train operators out there who aren't fully ready to do it. In fact, it could be four to five years before trainees actually get behind the controls. In Etobicoke, Audra Brown, City News.